I don't think I'll be moshing today. I know you have a heavy heart. I can feel it when you care. Where are my clothes, Chloe? Many men stronger than me. Ugh. Still reeks like a chlorine factory. See if you can find a suitable outfit in my fashion hole. I thought Chloe might put up a pic of me instead. Can't compete with Rachel. Holy shit balls. Frank is scary. I should have let Chloe take that money. Take a blunt. Might as well start blazing if I was dumb enough to get suspended for weed. Oh, at least we haven't been identified. Yet. Thank God she's okay. I wonder when I can visit her. The fact that she put the photo next to Rachel is so touching. What's so easy in the evening by the morning such a Yeah, she is probably active, isn't she? Wow. I remember this old phone. We decorated it together. Flip flip phones, man. Back in the day. Okay. Time for some Chloe cosplay. Hey, there you go. Rachel left a bunch of her clothes with me. She's your size. But not quite my style. Max, you don't have a style yet. At least give it a try. You can always rewind back to your chlorine brand t-shirt and generic jeans. You suck. I like my shirt and jeans. But it would be cool to try on Rachel's clothes just to see if they fit. Stop second guessing yourself, Max. Put this on and let your inner punk rock girl come out. You can afford to take chances whenever and whatever you want to try. For example, I dare you to kiss me. What? I double dare you. Kiss me now. <laughs> Here we go. This is the moment we've all been waiting for. I think there would be rage in the comment box if I didn't choose this, so I give the people what they want. Damn, you're hardcore, Max. Now I can text Warren and tell him he doesn't stand a chance. Unless he's into girl-on-girl -girl action. You're who, such a dork. Who isn't? Dang. Oh man, that was priceless when I kissed Chloe. She didn't think I would. Alright, let's put on the clothing. No peeking. Rip flannel, my favorite. Oh my god, Looking so evil. Looking sick, Max. A couple tats, some piercings, and we'll make a thrasher out of you yet. Ready for the mosh pit, shaka bra. Maybe not. Go on down and say hi to Joyce. Free breakfast? I have to, uh, wake and bake first. I promise not to tell. Let's not rewind and find out, okay? Stoner. Wow, sir. That was my 10th birthday. I didn't know Chloe kept this stuff. Whoa, she has normal hair. Who says wowzer these days? Who says that? All right. Oh my god, that smells so amazing. It's like when we were kids here. Selfie number 20. I'm actually surprised they gave let Kate use her cell phone if she's on so suicide watch. so good to wash my face after all that chlorine and hiding. You know, I haven't gone through a dyeing my hair blue phase yet. Maybe it's time. What's ironic is I always hated it when Chloe used my toothbrush. Hygiene first. 
Gotta get my fresh on. Chloe has had this damn dirty pirate towel since we were kids. <laughs> Serious flashback. Why is there a bird in here? No way. That's the bluebird I saved Monday in Joyce's room. Okay. Let us snoop. More snooping. Oh. It's all locked up. I better not go in there. David might be in bed. Ew. Your husband's a creep. Sup, Joyce? Good morning, Joyce. Rachel, uh, uh, I mean Max. Oh, you startled me. Well, you fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chow on. Pancakes. I'm dying for some of your famous pancakes. I thought you would have missed those. Ah, you ate more than William, and he loved them. <laughs> I remember. We would erase each other to grab them from a stack. So this time, you can help me with the ingredients. I need you to grab me the eggs and milk. That wasn't part milk? of the deal. No You're supposed to make me breakfast. Wowzer. Chloe still eats the same cereal. So do I. Now for the mother's milk. Why are my bones oh, so man. brittle? I don't want to be famous for this. I drink plenty of milk. Who drinks beer this early around here? Is that wine stain still on the floor? Oh, jeez. Can you help me get this bird out of here? Ready. Wait, maybe I should open the door first before I try to scare it out. No, no, no. That's not what I want you to do. I want you to open the door and keep it open. Because otherwise it's going to fly into the window. Alright, let's see what happens. We gotta let him out or Dave will shoot him with a thousand guns. Be gone. Fly, you fool. Okay, now we open this window. There we go. I keep expecting to see the sky turn red. Look at that. Preemptive. <laughs> Imagine we just see it gets eat eaten by a cat. <laughs> And now I'm depressed. I love that they still have the same refrigerator. Why is she wearing high heels? Where do I get eggs? David, this is Officer Corn. Just want to let you know your stepdaughter's car was identified near the Blackwell campus last night. Around the time of the break-ins. What? Give me a call soon. Are you in trouble again, Chloe? Don't you sleep? Yeah, we're gonna flush this. Message deleted. Goodbye, message. Her mom heard it though. Interesting. Let's see if she narks on us. Where the hell am I gonna get eggs if they're not in the fridge? Oh. Ooh. The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. This might be the one time these people are right. Thanks. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a good friend since you or Rachel. Those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. 
I'm just hoping she's living large in L.A. I'd love to think that too, Joyce, but... We are on the same page, Max. I keep hoping that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. Is there any reason that Rachel might be mad at Chloe and left without her? Chloe could piss everybody off but her. They were almost joined at the head. Reminded me of you and Chloe. But Rachel wasn't as grounded as you. I'm grounded? Since when? Maybe that's why Chloe likes Rachel so much. <laughs> Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? Maybe. Rachel was so much cooler than me. <laughs> you think? Then why has Chloe been telling me she wishes she could be more like you over the past five years? Doubt it. Um, did she really? Five years ago feels like a thousand now. And that makes me what, a century old? <laughs> You're only 18, Max. Oh, youth. If only I could go back. It's not all that, Joyce. Voila, a breakfast fit for us queens. And a king. <laughs> go sit at the table. God, I'm gonna have to sit and eat with David, aren't I? This is going to be Shay awkward. I wonder what I would have had to brought her if I wanted eggs and bacon. Well, eggs, of course. But. I guess nobody waters the plant here. Thank you so much. I'm glad that's creamy and not crunchy. Good, you can clean. Peanut butter jelly time. Peanut butter jelly time. I guess nobody waters the plant here. Now that's what I call pancakes. What am I supposed to do? Here. Oh, she's bringing me a book. Seeing you again. Ah, oh, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joyce. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. Uh, I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. Wow, sir. I totally remember that day. I'm glad. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, it was the last picture he ever took. He had his car out right after this, and... and... I know, Joyce. I'm sorry. I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, I want you to have this. This was when my baby was so full of life and light. She was hopeful, positive, and everything she's not today. And this was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. My ears are burning. Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? It's not always about you. Chloe, please, it's too early to start picking a fight. Eat instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Now stop whispering, or I'll know you're talking about me. Stop being so nosy, mother. Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. Uh, no one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me, I have to use the bathroom. Sure, run off and pee when you should back me up. Now, who's being paranoid? Just listen to yourself. Nobody else does. I do need to get into David's computer. He's got to be hiding shit. What shit? He's got to be password protected. No shit it needs a password. 
How about step douche? Try again. I need more clues. Nothing to see here. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. No. I doubt it's stepdad. Naturally, David would buy a heavy duty military. I can even see the combination. That might be a useful password. Nothing in it. Chloe can't get another gun now. Unless she steals it back from Frank. Let's turn this off. Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. Well, it better be his military ID. That's the only thing you remember. Off. Off by heart. I could try the license number for the password. No. Looks like David has read this a lot. What did he learn? David has been dragging his head around since 2001? Man, so much stuff. Dude, can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. Obviously, David's parents care about him. That date might be a good password. <laughs> 